Rock University, which is our, in St. Catharines, Ontario, Canada. It's near Niagara Falls in Canada. Um, my role there is ed tech support specialist, so I help a lot of faculty develop their courses, and then I teach myself. Teaching hacks. So I've gone through all the stuff I've picked up over about a decade, um, from top class to WebCT to um, Colleges, D2L, and Blackboard, and all the rest, and said, you know, these all have some common tools that we all know and love. Um, what's some crazy ways that we can recombine them, add some pedagogy, and have a really interesting uh, way to scratch that itch that you just couldn't quite figure out? And one that we got a lot of feedback on from today is if you go to uh, MediaPlayer at Yahoo.com, you can get a little script tag that uh, embeds straight into any HTML page and makes all the uh, media on that page, MP3s, video, playable. So one little script tag that puts it in. Uh, my personal hack when we started this all was something I call clandestine attendance. So when I teach, I ask students to do a quiz on the last class. So that they all get into the lab. I have a username and password on the whiteboard so I know that they're there. They put in that username and password, put their quiz or answer the questions about the last class so I know that they paid attention and studied. Most importantly, at the end, I kind of know who's in the room because they filled out that quiz. That's very good. And I think the uh, uh, third one's probably something about using maybe assignments or testing quizzes. Just ask your students how they learn best. And you can just have a little quiz and how do I learn? Get them maybe choose a profile you describe. Vicky likes to learn when things are demonstrated to her. Do you does that make sense to you? Or you personally like to hear something first? Just so you know how your students are learning and you can uh, change your teaching to that.